Hey guys, it's me. Wait a second, hold up for a second. Give me one gosh darn moment. Give me one, okay. Hey guys, me, my name is Alba Blink, and today we're gonna have some more fun alone in my room. Are you happy? Am I, am I, I'm happy. I'm satisfied with my life. Shut up, you're not my mother. This is a One Direction fan fiction because, of course, I um, am personally uh, in a romantic relationship with all of them. <clears throat> this is called Help Me Please, and it's a One Direction fan fiction, and the first chapter is called Help Me Please, and it's One Direction. Are you ready? Here we go. <laughs> I am only 15, so how could this happen to me? I am as nerdy as you can be. Straight 4.0 GPA. Never smoked, never done drugs, never had sex, never tasted alcohol. So why did he have to kidnap me? And how does One Direction fit into this mess? This is already stupid. Alright, this is a mature story. <laughs> She's 15, and this is going to be a mature story. Thank the Lord. One word to describe me? Hmm. It would probably be a tie between nerd and loser. Paragraph. Yup. Paragraph. Two words to describe me? A nerdy loser. You don't know what that is, okay? I, it's just, ugh, you know, whenever, ugh, you know, whenever, oh god, it turns me on. I have never been kissed, let alone have a boyfriend. Hi, grammar. I have never been to a high school party. So... They're not exactly the most hardcore events. I have never been near or had drugs. Instead of going out to the mall or partying it up like it's 3012, I'm gonna shoot myself. I go home and do my homework. I am living the boring life. Enough of my sob story. At least I get a 4.0. I mean, I have my life to have FN and party. Have FN and party? I have my life to have. Oh, I have my life to have fun and party. I have, I have my life to have fun and party, like the rest of it. God, why did it take me ten seconds to decipher a sentence in a One Direction fanfiction? <laughs> Though sometimes I feel down because I am school smart, not street smart. You know, there's a point at which those are the same thing. <laughs> you just gotta be better at being school smart than you will become street smart. It's called theater. <laughs> However, looking back, I wished I had realized how lucky I was before I had lost it all. The wind whipped my curly frizzy hair into my face as I fumbled through my backpack for my house key. <laughs> Good. I hate the winter time. It is so depressing and cold. <laughs> I hate winter. It is cold. It is sad. I hate winter. Thanks for the A, second grade teacher. You're my favorite. It gets so dark so early and I just don't like it. Dang it, I hissed as the key wouldn't turn in the lock. <laughs> oh, dang it is freezing god i wish that all young adult authors would just be in a pit and burn i guess that sounds wrong but i wish it so shut your head finally it worked that's another paragraph just mom i'm home i screeched as i trudged through the door i'm not having kids <laughs> because of this. The warm air hit my face as I stepped inside. You do not have to put a paragraph for every one of these things. These could all be a paragraph and better. <laughs> and not in a One Direction fan version. I sighed. Nothing. I hate silence. Wow, so far I have mentioned everything I hate. Said paragraph, 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 paragraph. I am not a downer type of person. I am actually very happy and cheerful. Just not when I have been through a long five days of school and have loads of home to complete. I have to do all the home. Everybody run. It's gonna get violent. Mom, hello. Dang it. Maybe she was running late. She better not be late. <laughs> she knows what happened last time. Who'll make my dinner now? Paragraph. I hummed a made-up song to myself as I turned on the lights. Paragraph. Weird, I thought, as I noticed the TV was missing. Paragraph. Hmm, maybe Mom wants to buy a new TV. Paragraph. I rummaged through the fridge when I heard something. Paragraph. I am normally a very paranoid person, so I dismissed the thought. Telling us what you are is not showing us what... Okay. All right. It's probably just the wind. Why couldn't I live in some place that's always warm and sunny, like L.A.? <laughs> Except when it rains all the time. Finally, I found a pink apple. I smiled. I love fruit. Those were different paragraphs. Finally, I found a pink apple. Paragraph. I smiled. Paragraph. 
I love fruit. Ah, <laughs> uh, see, most people love chocolate. I, on the other hand, would die for a piece of fruit. It's just so I don't know, amazing, nerdy. I know that's not what being a nerd is. Being a nerd is being exceptionally interested in biotechnology or like a specific field of biotechnology. That's what being a nerd is. Liking fruit is not a nerdy thing. Liking fruit. Jesus. As I was listening to the conversations in my head, there was a crash from the living room. Shit! All the voices in my head scream. The voices in her head are men. Shit! All the voices in my head screamed. Earthquake, maybe? I checked to see if anything was swaying. Paragraph. Nope. Paragraph. Dang it! Paragraph. Really forthful wind, maybe? Paragraph. Then I heard footsteps. Paragraph. Oh. Paragraph. My. Paragraph. Gosh. You know, suicide... Please don't be someone, please don't be someone, I mentally whispered as I froze in shock. When I was younger, I used to watch crime shows. Like, seriously. <laughs> in case you don't believe me. In case you... I watch a crime show. 24 7 I racked my brain to think of some game plan. The X's and the O's move in various directions. I reached over to get the kitchen phone when I realized it was gone. Shoot. Paragraph. Just. Period. My. Period. Luck. Period. Paragraph. Great. Now I need another plan. My cell phone. I took it out of my pocket to see it was dead. Are you ready? Frick me. Jesus. There is a phone up in my parents' room. I just need to get there first. Oh, wait, dumb person. Why don't you just escape the house? Duh. But the only door is in the front, and the living room is on the front. Game plan. Carry a knife and run for my life. Wait, would a 5'3", 110-pound girl with a knife be intimidating to a robber? I hope so. No. Oh, gosh. I hope so. I grabbed the largest meat knife I could find and inched my way into the living room. All right. <laughs> Are you ready? Are you ready for the grammar and the stuff? Crossing my fingers, I prayed those sounds I heard earlier were just my imagination playing Turks on me. Turks on me. Nope, this was real, paragraph. Stupidly, I gasped when I saw the back of a man covered in black. <laughs> whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Wait, was the back of the man covered in black? Was the man covered in black? What was the black? Why was he covered in it? I'm confused. <laughs> of course, like in all the movies I have seen, that little noise caught his attention. He turned around and my heart almost fell out of my chest. There you are, sweetie. Nice of you to join us. His raspy voice croaked. Please, I squeaked as he smirked. I put my arms out in a defensive position. Please! Nuh-uh, love. Please! I cried as I inched backwards. No, no. Those were different paragraphs. This can't really be happening, can it? I Suddenly, I hit a body behind me. A cloth was pasted over my mouth. There were two of them? Shh. Deep breaths. Calm down. Breathe, the man cooed in my ear. I was shaking like a leaf that was stuck in the windy wind. <laughs> Why do you think this is a good thing to publish? <laughs> I was shaking like a leaf that was caught in the windy wind. Oh no, oh no. Shit. <laughs> God. It's it's gonna be the death of me. But at least we'll both be numb. I kicked, scratch, clawed, and tried to bite as the man pinched my nose, forcing me to breathe through my mouth. Dude, you don't know how that the chloroform you just breathe it and in a couple seconds it takes hold. Like you don't have the time to kick and scratch and claw and such. Dang him. <laughs> Dang him Oh gosh, this is it. As the muffled screams and cries for help faded. Soon enough, I passed out in the arms of my kidnapper. Shit. <laughs> this was the worst way. The worst way to have a story. It went... Oh my god! Oh. We need to start teaching our ch killed kids to appreciate fine literature. D darn it, dang. Dang it, darn. Gosh, wow. <laughs> See, well, none of my things are funny because she already did them for me. <laughs> oh, no. Why does this happen to me? <laughs>
<laughs> well, you know what? That's it. That's the end. That's the end of the first chapter, I guess. I'll read the chapters later, maybe, if you want them. Maybe not. Maybe you don't want them. I don't want them. We're going to leave the next chapters later. So until next time, bye!